Okay, so now that you guys under, have an understanding of how the weight block works, I'm now going to put a put it inside a looping block. So what I'm going to do is go to flow control and drag the loop block and put it at the front and then I'm going to drag these three blocks and put them inside inside the looping block like this. So what that means is I'm going to keep repeating this set of instructions forever right because right now it says unlimited so the robot's going to move forward until the distance sensor senses something in front of it then it's going to rotate and then it's going to go back to the beginning and move forward again right so basically it's going to keep moving around uh, the edge of the room okay so if this works um, you can also try setting it to go for a number of times so let's say you want it to circle the room uh, let's say three times so just put three oops that's 33 let's put three times or something um, or you can just put unlimited and that will loop this an unlimited number of times I'm also going to modify it a little bit so when it senses that there is something in front of it I want to go back first so drag another move block just after it senses something I want it to go backwards All right so I'm gonna set the power level to negative 50 go backwards for um, two seconds All right, and then rotate and then move forward again so try that, download this program to your robot, see what happens. Alright, so that's the game work. Okay, thanks for watching.